Hi, and we are back here recording. It is now, as you can see up here at the corner, it is 1019. I have finally had the opportunity to uh, get iOS 5 on my iPhone. It's working okay. It took about 23 different tries. And I had uh, a 3000 error, like you've seen all over Twitter and uh, YouTube. I actually took the liberty in calling uh, Apple and because I have an a Apple Care account, they pretty much said that today and tomorrow if you have iOS 5 problems and you're trying to update, give them a call. They're going to waive people that do not have Apple Care, they're going to waive the fee for that for you to even talk to somebody they said that the reason why it's been broken is because there's been a lot of server um, functions they also continued by saying that the fact that if the Apple uh, servers got hammered in two different ways one the fact that Temp a, that the actual Lion um, 7.2 update was going on. Two, that iOS 5 came on board. The iOS 2 update brought you iCloud connectivity for your iMac or MacBook Pro devices. And of course, iOS iOS 5 is for your cell phone, your iPod, your iPad, your iOS devices. Um, pretty much what they told me to do was continue hitting update, 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 update. And eventually it's going to go through. After the 20th time, uh, it did go through. So let's see what happens. Um, I've talked to a lot of friends of mine that have had the same issue. When I spoke to the Apple employee, they said that there was about over 3,000 individuals that have had issues. So, what I'm talking about update is the following. Just hit update, 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 update. And eventually it's going to go through. Eventually it's going to be going through. Uh, so that is my response to what I said to you before. I will call back with more information on what I feel about iOS right now as you can see because the servers are still being hammered it's gonna take about four hours just to download the iPad update the um, iPhone update was 600 and something megabytes and now the iPad update is going to be 700 and something megabytes and four hours later uh, please stay tuned and let's see what happens with any other concerns that I might have. Thank you so much and have a great day.